Good morning. So, I'm gonna get to it. I've been left home alone for the week, for the next week. And that being the case, I won't have much to do at night. So I thought, I'm gonna give a go, give a try. Do you mind? I'm gonna try my hand at doing some daily vlogs, some daily training vlogs. Something I've never done before, something that nobody asked me to do, but yeah, I figured, what the heck. Uh, the weather is gonna be really nice all week. I'm gonna be riding a lot, so there should be, I don't know, something interesting in there. Um, yeah, so we're gonna give it a go. This morning, a Saturday, uh, but for the trainings, we've got about five hours on tap, um, so we're gonna meet up with a group, meet up with a group of guys, and yeah, head out west of Boise, and try and get five hours in. So we got a bowl of oatmeal, excuse me, a bowl of dope meal, our coffee, and this morning's stage of Trino Adriatico on the TV. So yeah, everything is so far right on schedule. So without further ado, welcome to a week of daily vlogs, day one, let's get after it. Hey, what, get out of there. Whew, I haven't done laundry in a while, so I'm very much dressed for the weather I want, not the weather I have. But it's super nice out today. And it's gonna warm up. This should be primo. smoothie for like the last hour of that ride. Oh, holy smokes. That was a big one. That was a big one. I ended up with seven guys, including myself, um, which was super cool because going into it, I thought there was going to be only four of us. So seven guys, we rode for five hours, three minutes, covered 105 miles, did 4,300 feet of climbing. And I'm curious, 278 watts for that whole ride which uh, is cool, but I am definitely gonna pay for that tomorrow. Um, because yeah, as awesome as today was, that was just day one of this weekend. 
the goal being doing back-to-back 100-mile rides, which I have never done before. For five hours a day, it goes by, honestly, super quick when you have a group like that. Everybody's strong. Everybody was, you know, just excited to be outside and riding in such beautiful weather. Um, so, yeah, it was just five hours of, of easy going. Not easy riding, but easy going. Now I have a dog licking my neck. Rory. Obviously this time last year, like everybody was having to ride on their own, but even kind of this time two years ago, we still were never getting like a solid group together to go out and do these long rides. <clears throat> um, so yeah, I mean, basically I did maybe one five hour ride last year. Whereas this year, since we've had like this consistent group coming together every Saturday and Sunday, honestly, um, it just means that the, the long rides have been way more consistent. And then, you know, kind of the ride within the ride, you're not just riding literally five or four hours at like zone two. You're riding predominantly endurance pace, but then you're still like having these, these moments of riding hard and like throwing in attacks and just like kind of having fun with it, letting the ride like flow and come to you. And it's just been so much better than, than this time last year for sure. But again, even this time two years ago. So what's on tap for the rest of the day? Basically gonna try and like stay as close to the ground as possible because as I've said before, the closer you are to the ground, the better you recover. Uh, Craig and Justin are coming over a little bit later tonight to have a small fire out back and maybe drink a beer or two because after five hours, gotta replenish those carbs. So yeah, between now and then, pretty much just gonna lay here and eat as much food and enjoy this freaking smoothie. So yeah, how's that for day one? Day one of this seven or eight days of daily vlogs, whatever it's gonna be. Um, yeah, hopefully you found some enjoyment out of it. If you did, feel free to subscribe and yeah, thanks for watching. See y'all tomorrow.